DI out of the second, out of the first pitch list. So. Oop. Vex. Tweet out all the stuff. Yeah, make sure you uh, share the stream, guys, whether you tell your friends about it or you tweet the stream out, because yep. we got two of the top players we see here just about every week. Well, we got a stack tournament this week. Yes, this week. yes, we, we do. We got Vex, we got Blue, we got False, we got Pasta, we got Luck, who's been on a tear. Yeah. But hey, we got Vex and Blue in winner's quarters, of all things, going to Smashville. DK Mewtwo, let's go. Mercy Mewtwo putting in some amount of work. It's going to be trouble, especially with that neutral neutral air and this uh, big body that DK has. Back to oh, wow, that great. Shoot. I greatly under I greatly <laughs> overestimated the uh, knockback throw on Mewtwo's back there. <laughs> there it is, that neutral just falling so down. So used to seeing Nest forward throw just kill there. So. Yep, just phasing in out there. Yeah, he's going to be looking for those forward. Uh, Vex is going to be looking for those forward air and back. I actually like kills. that. That's actually a really good time to use down B on Vex. Is that? Because if he, um, with the spacing, it was going to hit on the on the edge, so... Oh, wow! Shadow Ball just going to take him out. Red is recovery. Very I was going nice. to say, like, if he, if Blue was going to shield, it was going to break his shield eventually because all the shield's done. Right. And if he rolled, he was going to get hit by an enemy. He had to jump, and he didn't jump. Nair, Nair. Just are we going to see, are we going to see Nair footstool infinite? Oh, my God. No. What is that? Oh, footstool and ding! Go! That's going to give it to you! <laughs> First we gonna ding, then we gonna dong. <laughs> <laughs> Don't matter if you DI left or right, it's gonna be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm glad we made that. Anyways, yeah. I d d trust me, I planned all that. <laughs> <laughs> like for, uh, ever since the start, Vex will give it to you. I, I thought of that third line. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I know I come up with a lot of stuff on the fly. That was not on the fly. All right. All right. <laughs> Ooh, just letting the shadow ball go to cover the run in. Yep. Alright. We was just trying to attack on percent to get him to up, to up throw range. Right now, 110 is dangerous territory. That's so good. Yeah, that slide up smash is going to be... so good at resisting the temptation to air dodge on the way down. Mm -hmm. Almost had that read on that air, uh, air dodge. Mm -hmm. Which is tricky to do. No, no, no. Oh, no. oh wow, it did! Vex gonna give it to you! Holy crud! I didn't think that would kill! <laughs> Yo, DM Vex in the building! Yeah! <laughs> Oh wow, the chat already, the chat made that joke. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> like right at the same time. That's kind of cool. Um, yeah, yeah, purple tanuki. I remember. I remember. I follow you on Twitter. I remember. That was a nice match. Mm -hmm. It was looking like it was going one way, then it went the other. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. That was pretty quick. <laughs> but uh, you know, we're used to these particular matches going to be best of five. But you know, we're just winners quarters here. <laughs> yeah. All around, so much fun. Let's see here. Try to shorten this tweet a bit. Yeah, Rage plus Mewtwo's lightweight plus his floatiness. It did not add up that well. <laughs> They're just deciding where they want to go. It seems like I feel like they might go to Town and City because that, that just benefits both of them. Yep. But they're going to go to Battlefield. Blue likes Battlefield. Okay. This makes sense. Alright. Hopping into it. Alright. He's going for just trying to push her down tilt. Yeah. But so Mewtwo kind of has the better down tilt. Vex is trying to find a way to close in on these uh, just predictions of yep. attacks. Oh, oh gets disabled. the confusion. Very nice. Yeah. Uh, he could have charged. Eh, you know what? Don't risk it. Oh, no. Okay, he was able that. to mash out of it pretty quick. So, yeah. yeah. No, because the the, uh, the amount of time you're locked in that depends on percent. Oh, I didn't realize Vex okay. had as low percent as he had. He was good. Almost gets that spike read. That's such a good option. That, it is. That, that Nair, like, covers every option if you, like, can fastball, right? Mm -hmm. It's actually just like Bayonetta's now I think about it. Yeah. Because hers will cover every option if you can, uh, if you start at the right point and can leave with it. Right now, Dude, Blue is doing a really great job just predicting these, uh, air dodges from the X. Especially off these edge guards. Yeah, Mewtwo's just doing... He's doing a really good job of just staying underneath the platforms and poking at him from Here below. Here it goes again. No, okay. Oh, great! Yeah. Read the roll, goes to the Shadow Ball. Pretty. Oh! Almost had it, but a double air dodge from Blue. So, just barely missed the timing there with that right. air dodge read. But that's just Mewtwo's air dodge for you. Missed that forward air off. So, so tough to punish. And he fell off the platform, so that set him up. Yep. <laughs> Soft up tilt. Like, he's just using up tilt to cover the platform. Ding! Dong! That's gonna give it to you! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm glad that we all got in, though. <laughs> 
get a little bit of bass for that. <laughs> My voice gets gravelly when I hit the bass. Yeah, so. we just, yeah. <laughs> just throwing random dubstep sounds to that. <laughs> Thanks, go. Blah, blah, blah. All right. All right, that's a little. <laughs> this calls out wow, the read the again. Read. Vex is gonna go to losers. Uh, is gonna go to losers bracket in the winners' quarters. A very quick 2-0 from the. Never mind. I'm completely wrong. Yes, this is yes. a one-one set. Yes. I forgot how quickly he got killed by the. By the other game. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I look like an idiot after that one. We actually go into game three on this I'm wonderful not, set. I'm Hopefully, not, no I'm one not can hear me anything. on the outside. Of that I'm, I'm not saying anything. So that's cool. <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> What if, I wonder if Vex like heard me through all that and he just got mad. That'd be cool. Ooh, who's going Charizard? Battle of the big bodies here. And we're going to Dreamland. I know Vex loves Dreamland. And Charizard likes it. Not as much as Donk Donk does. Right. <coughs> Alright, so we do have both these characters being heavyweights, so it should even out yeah. a little bit. Perfect. Okay, we went for Nair instead of Fair. Usually they go for Fair. Right. I guess, actually, yeah, on a heavyweight, you can probably go for Nair and just get a re-grab, because the knockback's low enough. Mm. I did main Charizard for a hot minute. But, okay. You know, when he got his, like, combo throw and, like, it had some potential. Right. I just kind of flashed over him. <laughs> I haven't picked him up in a while. I should pick him up again, just for the heck of it. <laughs> Pretty much, it's even all around, but then Blue's looking to change that up right now. Right. Thing is, though, now this is actually an interesting dynamic here. Uh -huh. Charizard wants Vex to be above him. Vex yeah. wants Char Vex wants to be on the platform. So, like, you'd think that that would favor Blue, but Vex is, you know, doing a lot. Oh, if he didn't snap too. Vex is doing a good job hanging in there, but yeah. Because uh, Vex wants to get on the platform, he's gonna early ding dong kill. But Charizard can cover it with up smash. He can punish the top platform with up air and have pretty much no lag when he lands. Right. Cause it'll auto cancel out of a full hop. But... Ooh, great B reverse on that rock yeah. smash. Nice landing option. Yep. And again with that, like he's going for back air because it's it's a lot safer if he sweet spotted. Yeah, and that animation on Charizard when he turns around can trick people out by looks of it. Yeah. Watch this match just end with a yellow flare blitz. Oh, oh no, so a bit close. too much rage. <laughs> Blue also might have been DIing up, which is an option for it's the first hit Yeah, yeah, yeah. Charizard's also floating. So Down throw the into four. Okay, couldn't no. get it. It's not good to burn anymore. Yeah. We'll have to wait on air dodge. And Vex is. Oh, oh no. Okay, he got hit. By I don't him. think that can two frame. No, no, it, it wasn't that. I, for some reason, I thought he grabbed the ledge, but he got oh, hit okay. by just one hit of uh, flames. So he's okay. Good. Only one hit of Charizard to make escape. He only was the one track. Or... Huh. He just up, up throw, throw that platform. on the top platform. Yep. That's how Blue got me the time that, that we faced. <laughs> up throw on the top platform. Always a good option. And that's why Charizard's so good here and on uh, Battlefield. Right, and here we are. No, no, no. The rage is not a factor. I think Blue's, the, the floatiness and the percentage he's at, it's not going to connect anymore. Yeah. Vex has to find another option. And granted, DK has plenty of kill options, but none of them are as safe as Ding Dong. Uh-huh. But back, back here, though. That's probably his best bet. Oh, oh no, and he's too low! Oh, my oh, God! wow! <laughs> Gets stomped on the way back, and he can't make it back up. So that's... So now I can I can say what I was saying before, and <laughs> Blue does, in fact, send Vex into loser's bracket in winner's quarters. So Woo. look out, loser's bracket. You got luck and uh, Vex going out there. <laughs> it's a scary place to be right now. Yeah, and right now we will see... Uh